Hey everybody, it's Mikey Winfield, comedian from Baltimore slash Sacramento. It doesn't have to make sense to you, it makes sense to me! I worked in the worst department at the grocery store. Not the meat, not produce, not the freeze. I worked in the steel department. You familiar with the steel department, right? Self-checkout lane? I have been doing stand-up close to 20 years. Unbelievable. That's insane even when I think about it. Hey everybody, I'm Shu Takada from Japan. I heard the judges um, have seen the yo-yos before. I was really worried about they like or not. We've seen a lot of yo-yo acts over the years. They've been a bit boring. boring. I was nervous boring. so much, yeah, because it was one of my dream to be on stage at America's Got Talent. We rock the show and everybody in the crowd's like, go, go, go. Cause when I get a mic and I start to flow, I don't stop, I just go, go, go. stands for hugs, kisses, and OMG, we love hugs and kisses. <laughs> and we are a pop group, so we have to have the pop. <laughs> yeah. Hey everybody, my name is Mervon Vera. I'm from Philadelphia, PA. I've done a lot of shows, but man, that was different. I was nervous to step on that stage, but it went well. Look close, I'm talking eyes burning. This is just another lesson. I'm lucky like number seven. Wouldn't believe this rap had five virgins, but the sixth set may be the best yet. You know why? Cause I wear a king suit, no tie. Uh, I've never performed on a stage this big. I've performed in bars and clubs, amphitheaters, but never on a stage this grand. As soon as I got into the gist of it, I was like, you know what, we're here, let's, let's have fun, let's do this. And I got so much energy from the audience. I was bursting with energy. So we have been performing to, with each other for about a year now. Mm -hmm. It's almost <laughs> our one year anniversary together. Oh my God, it's crazy. <laughs> We're already, like we just started this group and we're already inspiring so many kids and yeah. they're like already <laughs> wanting to watch us. So it's so crazy how the rumors spread like this. <laughs> Especially Howie Mandel. Howie like, Mandel. What's yeah. his granddaughter to watch us? Like that's crazy. And he said that on America's Got Talent. I mean, I know. Oh my God. that's just insane. <laughs> I have a granddaughter that's seven years old. This is the concert that she would want to be at. This is what you would want to see. You should have your own show. You should be touring. And I think that's exactly what you're going to do. And people think you're stupid. Like, you know when they're going to rob you when they're bringing up their stuff, they always got to look back up at you. They're like, boop, boop. <laughs> this one dude tried to humiliate me. Like, I knew he was going to rob us because I'm looking at him. He's looking at me. I'm like, just steal it. You know, it was interesting talking to Terry Crews before I went out because he has energy and you just kind of get amped up. Like anyone that talks to you with this bubbly energy kind of fires you up to perform. So and I think that's what I wanted. Very helpful to just be juiced up before I walked out there. I've been practicing yo-yo almost 20 years. I started yo-yo when I was six years old because my dad played yo-yo as a hobby. One day he showed off me the yo-yo tricks. It was so annoying for me. <laughs> like, hey, can you do this? Uh, this is lock the baby. I want my own show and travel around the world with my yo-yo performance. And I want to share the coolness of yo-yoing. You made cool. the yo-yo cool, fun. You're not just a yo-yo artist. You're a great performer. You're a dancer. And I've never seen anything like that. Incredible. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm trying to get those I got one heart for two arts, so I have to grind. Otherwise, I'll be sitting around feeling asinine. Jack of all trades, gold thoughts that I have to mind. Always trying to change my two tens, that's a paradigm. A paradigm's I probably go see ya. 
paradigms like Heidi and Sophia. I'm a showman, so allow me to show you how I'm good with the jokes like Howie. Doing this for Simon so the world might hear me. Cruise to the top and get jacked like Terry. So, whether you were born a jack, a queen, or an ace, or raised as a diamond, joke a spade, or an eight. Simon said he was a little mad at me because I haven't auditioned before. Uh, I think that it was just the good timing. Um, a couple years ago, maybe I didn't feel ready or something, but I'm so glad I'm here now. Thank you so much, everyone. I cannot wait to show you what I have planned for round two. Tune in. <laughs>